Hey, what's up guys, it's C-Stacks. We're here at Gen Con, the 5K just concluded, and we are here with the runner-up, second place. We got John Phillips. Second uh, place. I'll take it, <laughs> it's not bad. Tell us a little bit about your deck real quick, because there's an interesting story here. Um, oh, so you want like how it was built? Yeah, tell okay. about how so, you built it, why you landed on that. Uh, so it's called Mimic Cannon, because it's a combo deck. It's trying to kill you on two. Uh, you need four cards, you need a, two yellows, a blue and a pixie. Uh, you're playing Mimic as your MC. You have a bunch of plot twists, so level one, you're Emma Frost, so you get an extra draw. If your opponent attacks, you get to draw a card on their turn. If you attack your opponent, you get to draw on your turn. Uh, turn two, you want to, you want, in an ideal world, you want to play Pixie on two, Pixie into a Goblin Queen, who's your only other support character. Um, then you use Goblin Queen's ability to level up your Mimic, and then all of the uh, Femme plot twist and A-Force plot twist kind of uh, push you over to be able to stun their board with those six characters, because you have like Tim Fatality, who's six, it's six minus counters, but on turn two, that's pretty much going to kill anything. Uh, you have the, the five-man team attack with Heroines of Arcadia, uh, so that's a plus, what is that, plus 15 pump off of one card in that situation. Uh, you have late mutation to, to snuff out a couple of support characters. Uh, you have cat fights to get you through. The cat fights are actually like super relevant because when you, you become Deadpool at level two, you pay your yellow. If they have the fine coverage, you're not playing the chest person that is to kill them. So if they have like combat plot twists, that plus four makes you an eight. So they're zero one. So they need a lot of pumps to get through. Them, so. uh, I had no idea what I was playing until the car right up here. We're driving up on the road trip on Wednesday, which is apparently when I do my best brainstorming. Um, we were trying to think of like a Pixie Max in the set, which is actually kind of funny because there ended up being a Pixie Max in the set here. Um, but that's a six card combo, and and then I was like, so I uh, one of my guys was talking about how Goblin Queen would be funny to Pixie into to like make mimics skip their their two drops so that they have to actually fight you fair. And then I realized that that just adds up to six. So if you're a mimic, you just can pick C into Goblin Queen and level up on, on two. So that's a four card combo, which is better than a six card combo. Uh, that's how we got up there. So, fun deck to play. It's uh, very fickle. It has a fail rate, thus, thus the finals. <laughs> so, how did Swiss go for you? You won the regionals, so you had two buys. Yep. And then, how did the rest of Swiss go? The rest of Swiss. Uh, Pretty well. Uh, we had I went. I had three losses, so I had three games where I was not able to combo because it seemed like there was no game that I comp I know, there was no game that I got the four cards that I lost. So uh, a lot of the eight cards for the format were uh, Timbu, I get Scarlet Witch, and Jessica Jones. Of the three, only <laughs> one of them hurts me, and the one that hits on turn three. So if I'm, hit, if I'm killing you on my turn three, if I go first, or my turn two, if you go first, then I'll have to worry about your only hate card against me. So that was my general strategy. I figured all the decks we had built were going 50-50 anyway, with all the other decks. So I decided, let's just play the fastest deck that, uh, if I'm going to roll the dice to see if I win, I might as well be the fastest guy in the room. Who would you play against in top eight? Uh, top eight, I played against Rogue in the first match. Uh, he was a higher seed, so we got to go first. Uh, game one, I comboed out on two. Killed him. Game two, he 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 hit like a bunch of eight pieces, but I also just like wasn't seeing my pieces. I had them all again. It was just a rough game, but again, like I said, it has the fail rate. If you don't see your cards, you're just gonna lose. And I kind of just went in. Um, it was also kind of rough because I drew on my team. Stamp plot twist rather than my neutral plot twist, so I got to draw less cards, which is unfortunate because players tried it before. And then game three, I, I killed the one two again. Nice, it felt great. Uh, <laughs> and then semifinals was Mimic. Uh, he was playing a more traditional Mimic. The first game I thought I was gonna lose, I thought I was in trouble. He got a net launcher out on three and just started net launchering me down because he got to go first. Yep. Um, and I was like, oh man, I'm gonna die. And he didn't have the, the sixth character to level up and kill me. So he passed the turn to me and ran out, he had ran out of blues. 
so he couldn't net launch me. So uh, he passed the turn to me with five XP for both of them, or for him, not for me. Uh, so I played my uh, I played my pixie because we were on like turn like five or six, which was weird territory for me. But I was face down with the nitro launcher all game. I finally got turned up. I had the combo because I had a million turns to draw cards, um, and I, I used my combo, which the, the XP lined up that he actually missed his level two completely. So even if we went like further, he wasn't—he didn't have his yellow ability, so he had to put five, four wounds on me. So, uh, and then we game two. He went first again, but then I just—I hit it on two. And it was over. So, uh, and then the finals. Uh, uh, it was rough, <laughs> you know. Like it was, it was what we knew the deck was gonna do. It, it had a chance to just collapse on itself, and it did. Um, game one, I'm all again. I think I had like two of my combo pieces. Game two, I had the three locations. I have a pixie, which is the hardest piece to find because you only get four copies instead of the seven or eight copies of the other pieces. Um, it is what it is. It was a fun tournament. Ashley deserved it. I didn't deserve it. That was a scumbag deck. <laughs> <laughs> well, congrats on second place. It's pretty incredible. Thank you. Deck built on the, the drive up. Yeah. And it, I mean, it, it, it worked to a point. It, worked, it, it did pretty well, yeah? Yeah, it did, it did what I wanted it to do. All right, well, congrats again.